Welcome back to MovementRefreshal.com. So today we're gonna to take a look at a side hollow position. So we're gonna get on the side here and what we wanna focus on with any type of core specific hold is that we always wanna feel like we're finding our center, our, our abdominals, but we wanna feel like we're moving inward with the abdominals so that the belly button is moving in, the ribs are coming down, and that there's a general direction inward as we exhale. So as we get on the side here, we're gonna to try to feel that, and then we're gonna reach the legs long, and then the other focus is gonna be on the back of the legs, so where the inner thighs connect and right into the buttocks. So inner thighs into the butt, I like to think of that as a posterior seam or a seam in the backside. So when we look at the angle from uh, down the line, we wanna make sure that the feet are slightly out in front of the body here, not behind it, because that's gonna promote more extension. So we're gonna get this back seam here, we're gonna get the belly drawn in, and then we're gonna to try to keep the body as in line as possible. So shoulders over the hips. We're gonna reach out long. So instead of thinking lift, we're thinking reach the legs long and let them hover. Belly comes in, back seam is engaged, and we can use this top hand to give us some balance, and we're resting the head into the bicep. So the bottom arm can either be straight and lengthened out, or it could be bent to give us support, but the key is that we're just resting the head into the, onto the bicep, and then eventually we're trying to reach both the, the bottom arm and the legs long away from each other, but we just use this top arm as like a little kickstand. So as we hang out here and breathe out, our belly's coming in, we're gonna feel these top abs working, and then we're gonna feel the, the back seam through there. All right, so that would be the 